I told my friend Darren I would uh, post a video of how this go-kart is built and I'm going to do that right now. This go-kart was a trike. This piece of metal was welded on where you used to have the seat, the gas tank put on top of that. Come down here you can see this is the old foot peg now has this support welded on over top like that. This is the gear shift and has had a little antler welded on the bottom there and pinned on. That goes all the way up front here to the gear shift. So when you pull that up or down, it just moves that. Brake pedal, which is right here, step on the brake, it goes back to the old brake cable over there and it just pulls on that like that. We'll go around the other side. The gas pedal on a pivot here, like that. This is just an old piece of coat hanger there. Goes all the way up and just hooks onto the thumb drive, the thumb throttle cable that used to be off the handlebars. This is a steering wheel off an airplane, although anything would work, but this is good because your legs fit under there. You can see it's kind of like a butterfly. That comes down here Oops. to this piece here. It turns back and forth to a very basic suspension up at the front. In fact, there isn't sp working springs of any kind. There's your frame, the green support up to the green loop so if you roll you don't kill yourself. And that's about all she wrote. These are actually wheelbarrow tires which are completely insufficient and they're only held on with that cotter pin. I would change that. This is your secondary brake here just with the normal cable. And that is how you build a go-kart in a fast hurry.